afraid. The truth is, sometimes Reed is right. Avengers 5 just got a fresh title, new directors and an official villain, but the big buzz among MCU fans is about who's playing that villain. At Marvel's Comic-Con panel, they announced that Joe and Anthony Russo are returning to direct Avengers Doomsday and Avengers Secret Wars. Plus, Robert Downey Jr. is back, but this time he's not playing Iron Man, he'll be taking on the role of Doctor Doom. The Russos are stepping in for the original director, Destin Daniel Cretton, who left the project back in November 2023. Michael Waldron, who's already writing Avengers Secret Wars, is also joining the team as a writer, taking over from Jeff Loveness. In February 2024, news came out that Marvel was revamping Avengers 5, and it won't be called Avengers the Kang Dynasty anymore. This change followed Jonathan Majors being dropped by Marvel on December 18, 2023, after he was found guilty of assault and harassment. The next Avengers movie is part of a double feature that will wrap up the multiverse saga, but before we dive into Secret Wars, there's still a lot to tackle with Avengers 5. Here's the scoop on Avengers 5, also known as Avengers Doomsday. Let's start with who's on the Avengers 5 team. So far, only a few MCU characters have been confirmed for Avengers Doomsday. Most of these were announced at SDCC, and we'll have to wait and see who else might join the lineup. They'll be teaming up with Robert Downey Jr., who's making a surprise return to the MCU as the main villain, a reveal that definitely caught everyone off guard during the SDCC panel. Benedict Cumberbatch confirmed in a Netflix interview that he's involved in Avengers Doomsday. This isn't really surprising, since Doctor Strange has become deeply tied to the multiverse after the events of Spider-Man No Way Home and Doctor Strange in the Multiverse of Madness, where he found himself caught up in multiversal chaos and even caused an incursion. It's still unclear whether Doctor Strange 3 will come out before or after Avengers Doomsday, but it's pretty certain that Doctor Strange will have a major role in the film. Kevin Feige announced at this year's SDCC that the Fantastic Four will be making their comeback in Avengers Doomsday. The team is set to debut in the Fantastic Four First Steps on July 25, 2025, which might also introduce Doctor Doom. If that's the case, Avengers Doomsday will likely build on their introduction, positioning the Fantastic Four as major players in the upcoming Avengers film. While the Fantastic Four have been part of various Avengers lineups in the comics, they've never appeared together as a team. However, if they're going to be central to Avengers Doomsday, it makes sense that they'll team up with the Earth's Mightiest Heroes. As for the Thunderbolts, Kevin Feige has kept quiet about which members of Marvel's Thunderbolts team will show up in Avengers Doomsday, likely to avoid spoiling their upcoming team-up film. Still, it's exciting to know that the 2025 Thunderbolts movie won't be the last time we see some of these anti-heroes. The Thunderbolts have often been likened to DC's Suicide Squad, and if Marvel decides to follow a similar path, it's reasonable to think that some members might not make it out of their own movie alive. So it makes sense why Feige is keeping his plans under wraps. MCU Phase 4, 5, and 6 heroes most likely to join the Avengers in Doomsday While nothing is officially confirmed yet, there are plenty of MCU mainstays that are likely to show up in Avengers Doomsday. This includes characters whose recent storylines set them up for a return, as well as familiar faces from previous Avengers teams. Here's a rundown of the characters most likely to join the Avengers in Avengers Doomsday. First is Sam Wilson's Captain America. Footage from Captain America Brave New World shows President Thaddeus Ross tasking him with reforming the Avengers. Although Sam doesn't have extensive experience with the team, he could bring a fresh leadership dynamic in Avengers Doomsday. We are also likely to see James Rhodes, also known as War Machine, in Avengers Doomsday. Following the revelations in Secret Invasion that he was replaced by a Skrull, Rhodey is likely motivated to clear his name and uphold Tony Stark's legacy. With Armor Wars on the horizon, where much of this storyline will unfold, it's unlikely he would sit out Avengers Doomsday. The narrative potential of him confronting a villain who resembles his late best friend Tony Stark adds compelling depth to his character arc. Captain Marvel is expected to play a significant role in Avengers Doomsday, as she has strong ties to the Avengers and a history of collaborating with key characters like Bruce Banner and Wong. 
Although she typically focuses on cosmic threats, her interest in exploring other universes, especially after Monica Rambeau's situation in the Marvels, highlights her growing importance in the team. Bruce Banner, with his son Scar introduced in She-Hulk, is also poised to return, ensuring his strong connections to the Avengers continue to be pivotal. Additionally, Wong, the Sorcerer Supreme, is likely to be essential in safeguarding Earth from interdimensional threats, working alongside Captain Marvel and Bruce Banner to confront the challenges ahead. Thor is expected to return as well. Last seen with his daughter Love, he's positioned for another team-up against Doctor Doom, especially after the introduction of Hercules in Thor Love and Thunder. Shuri as Black Panther will also be involved. After her contributions in Avengers Infinity War and assuming the Black Panther mantle, her commitment to protecting Wakanda and Earth makes her a natural ally. Spider-Man, with his identity hidden again, remains a key player. His potential interactions with a Doctor Doom resembling Tony Stark and the hint of a symbiote add exciting possibilities for his character. Shang-Chi is poised for another spotlight moment. His ten rings have already attracted the attention of key Avengers, suggesting his involvement could add an interesting dynamic as a newer team member. And lastly, Star-Lord, now on Earth with his grandfather, is set to return. The message at the end of Guardians of the Galaxy Volume 3 indicates that Avengers Doomsday is likely the next chapter for him, given his established relationships with other Avengers. Now that we've covered all the characters set to appear, there's something important that seems to be slipping people's minds. Marvel is taking a big risk with its main villains and heroes in Avengers 5. Phase 6's Avengers Doomsday will introduce the MCU's next major villain alongside a fresh team of superheroes, but this event might come a bit too late. The MCU is gearing up to introduce a key element of its Avengers Doomsday and Avengers Secret Wars storyline, the Fantastic Four. Marvel's first family has been missing throughout the MCU's history, but Matt Shackman's upcoming Fantastic Four movie is set to change that. The main versions of Reed Richards, Sue Storm, Ben Grimm and Johnny Storm will come from another universe and are expected to join the rest of the MCU's heroes from Earth-616 at the conclusion of the Fantastic Four, Avengers Doomsday or Avengers Secret Wars. Not only are the Fantastic Four and Doctor Doom iconic characters in Marvel lore, but they also play pivotal roles in Marvel's 2015 Secret War storyline which is likely the inspiration for the MCU's upcoming Avengers Doomsday and Secret Wars. In the Secret Wars comics, Doctor Doom creates a personal kingdom by reshaping the multiverse, but Reed Richards ultimately challenges him, restoring the multiverse and leading to a temporary redemption for Doom. This dynamic will likely be adapted in the MCU, but both characters will be introduced right before or during Avengers Doomsday. In the multiverse saga, it seems that the MCU's new main hero and villain have not yet been revealed. Unlike the Infinity Saga, which gradually built up to Thanos through cameos and a roster of heroes over 20 films, the Multiverse Saga has yet to establish a clear lead-up to its major characters. For example, Captain Marvel, portrayed by Brie Larson, was introduced in the same year as Avengers Endgame, which limited her involvement in the crossover film. If the MCU remains faithful to the source material, Avengers Secret Wars could end with Reed Richards defeating Doctor Doom, effectively concluding their rivalry. This scenario presents two potential challenges for the MCU. If the Fantastic Four and Doom's first encounter in the MCU is their most significant battle, it could diminish the weight of their ongoing conflict. Alternatively, if it leads to a massive multiversal war, it could set an impossibly high standard for future installments, leaving fans wondering how the franchise can escalate beyond such a monumental clash. Well, that's it. What are you most excited about in the upcoming Avengers film, and how do you think the dynamics between the heroes and Doctor Doom will play out? Share your thoughts in the comments below, and don't forget to subscribe for more updates and insights on everything Marvel. See you next time!